Delroy, because when I, I looked at your information, it said an English actor. So tell us a little about where you come from. <clears throat> I was born in England. And it's interesting, you know, with the advent of the internet, et cetera, um, I'm not sure who referred to me as an English actor, but for many years, people didn't know I was from England. And it's only in the last, I don't know, maybe 15 years with the explosion of the internet and, and the fact that really there is no privacy anymore, uh, um, that it, the people understand that. Now, there was never anything that I was ashamed of, but bottom line is this, I was born in England as a result of the fact, my family is Jamaican. Any Jamaicans in the house? Woo! One, <laughs> two, three, three. Yeah, all right there, all right there. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, uh, my family is Jamaican, and um, there is a history that I've been investigating in the last 10, 12 years as a result of, um, I'm in the process of getting a master's degree from NYU. And, thank you. Um, and uh, my thesis started out as a, uh, as a, um, a screenplay of my mom's life, how my mom ended up being in England, etc. But then I did so much research um, that I've now changed it to a research uh, thesis. But to your question, um, my mom was part of a whole movement of people from the Caribbean moving to England, to the UK, the United Kingdom, starting in 1948. June 22nd, 1948, there is a ship called the Empire Wind, Windrush that lands in uh, England at a place called Essex, Tilbury Docks in Essex, and it carries on the ship over 400 Jamaican men. As a result of the fact that the United Kingdom had colonized all these islands in the Caribbean. All of these Caribbean people were English, were British citizens. After World War II, the British needed help reorganizing uh, uh, the country. So they said to all these Caribbean people, come over to England and help us get our country back together. Now, what they didn't understand, what they thought was that all these Caribbean people would come, help, and then go home. <laughs> Sight. <laughs> Guess what happened? All these black people from the Caribbean came over to England and said, wait a minute, I'm British. I'm a British citizen. I'm staying. I don't, I don't have anything to go back to. My mom was part of that influx of people from the Caribbean, which is how I came to be born in England. And that generation uh, of, of Caribbean people, starting in 1948 through the 50s, 1960, it peaked in the 1960s and 1970s, that generation of Caribbean people became known as the Windrush generation. My mom was part of that. And that's how I came to be born in England. You know what, y'all? I tend to be very long-winded, okay? <laughs> Right. Look here. If I get too long, just do this. <laughs>